Hey guys, what's up? This is Sparks, and I'm going to be showing you guys how to install the Arcane Scrolls mod for Minecraft. So if you guys check out the link in the description, it'll say Arcane Scrolls. You want to scroll all the way down there, and um, you just it'll take you right to this website right here. And this is the Minecraft forum page. You're going to want to scroll all the way down to the um, installation here, and just down below that is the downloads. So if you guys see this downloads, you're always going to want to do the latest. Um, so currently it is 1.6.1. So you're just going to click on the Arcane Scrolls right there, download and save that on your desktop. It should look just like that 1.6.1 arcane scrolls um, So that is the latest version um, also another thing that you're actually going to need from this mod um, is the Duke core and that is actually required for this mod so you're going to need to click here to download that so just click there and uh, go to the downloads right here the latest it always be the latest download and say the Duke core so just save that right underneath it right there Duke core right there so save those on your desktop just like that now the third thing you actually guys are actually going to be required to download is Minecraft Forge Minecraft Forge is very easy to install so you, it'll be it'll be the most easy thing to install in this mod so you're going to go down here all downloads you're always going to make sure you download the very top version and you're always going to want to make sure you download the installer. So just click on the installer there and save that onto your desktop just like that. So Minecraft Forge installer. So first thing you're going to want to do is open that. So it'll say, uh, welcome to the simple Forge installer, uh, Forge 8.9. Install client, push OK, and it'll install Forge for you. So that's very easy, very simple. Um, as soon as it gets done, it'll say successfully installed client profile Forge for version uh, for the version that is into launcher. So push OK there, and you guys are ready to start installing the mod. So with the Forge installer, it's very easy to do that. Um, after you have installed the Forge, what you're going to want to do is open Minecraft. And uh, if you guys, it'll be in the 1.6 launcher. So you, if you guys haven't actually installed the 1.6 launcher, you're going to need to do that. So if you guys don't know how, I will post a link in the um, in description below. So if you guys don't know how to do that, I'll show you guys how to do that. Um, I'll show you guys how to download the new launcher. So first thing you're going to want to do is go to Edit Profile. And when, you, when you're going to see this right here, you're going to want to use version and when and if it doesn't say release forge right here um, you're gonna it'll probably say use latest version or release 1.6.1 when you first do it but what you're gonna want to do is you want to go down to release forge 8.9 so just push ok push save profile and it will say version release in forge right there so you're just gonna want to do that push play let's see if it logs me in automatically I don't know nope okay so I have to put in my username and stuff so I'll put that right in just a second okay so now that I have all that in we'll push play and it will go through say welcome sparks to minecraft it's gonna say all this stuff on um, the green bar down here is actually where it's going to be loading so the reason why I'm pushing play and I'm actually starting up minecraft is because um, the minecraft forge the minecraft forge is actually gonna set up my folders and different things that I need it's gonna set up my mods folder the one that I'm actually gonna need to put the arcane scrolls and stuff in and I just wanted to kind of start it up just to show you guys um, that you know forge is working I always recommend to do this because um, it, it just shows you your progression so if if you if you get to this point and you get a black screen and something's not working it's because your minecraft forge isn't working correctly so I'm not sure why this is um, if you just follow exactly like I did it just start up the launcher it should work correctly other than that I really have no idea and I apologize if you guys are having issues anyway if you're here and it says minecraft 1.6.1 three mods loaded three mods active just push quit game because it has actually started your stuff so um, if you guys actually go to down to start here and you type in to start, you just type in percent a p p d a t e. This percent app data and another percent. You're gonna see this roaming folder right here. You wanna click on that roaming folder and you're gonna see this dot Minecraft folder on the very top here. You wanna open that dot Minecraft folder and it should have created a mods folder if you had started the game and pushed play so if you just open that mods folder make sure that folder is empty and the only thing you actually have to do is, is drag the arcane scrolls and the duke core straight into the mods folder um, just like that put just you can close that again and then go back to play and we're gonna start this up again and I'm just gonna show you guys that that's actually installed and uh, just because you know it's it's it is very early into the 1.6.1 update and I, hey I want to find out if it actually worked too so you know I might not always be correct so I want to make sure this works um, so I'm just gonna let that uh, go and okay so 1.6.1 is loaded I don't know why the Mojang screen takes so long to come up it's uh I don't know they need to fix that like it takes so long to load and it used to di it didn't used to do that I don't know why like the Mojang screen takes forever so the uh, okay so you can see now the five mods loaded five mods active I have actually go to the mods there scroll all the way down you're gonna see the Duke core and 
the Arcane Scrolls is installed, and you guys are ready to play. So it says mod state available, and you guys are ready to play the Arcane Scrolls mod. So hopefully this video helped you guys out. If it did, please give this video a like. Um, that always helps on videos, and if you guys like mod reviews and mod installs, I'm going to be doing them a lot on my channel, especially for the 1.6.1, because installation has changed a little bit, and it is a little bit more difficult. So, uh, yeah, again, thank you guys so much for watching.